Hey there, welcome back guys. This video is special thanks to Canes from Wavenote for sending us the Wavenote AI voice recorder. And as you can see, it's still charging, but if we click on the battery, even though it says medium, click on that little info button. And as you can see, it's charging. Charge required, less than two hours left. If it's, if it's in the red, less than five hours, five to 15, 15 to 30, and you'll get a maximum of 30 to 42 hours, depending on how much recording you're gonna do. But always keep that charger handy because you just never know how much is left until you actually check on there. And ideally for me, the starter plan is gonna work out just right. And as you can see, you can go pro 2000 minutes. If you're an attorney, you probably need the unlimited plan. If you're a medical student, maybe 2000 minutes, you have to decide which plan works for you. Like I know this is a one-time purchase and, um, 500 minutes is going to be more than they need to be because I'm going to do after each call, push it my, to my computer. So I always have that backup and of course, save a copy here. And as you can see here, there's a little connect button. So if we press connect, it's going to connect to it. So you always want to make sure maybe you disconnect when you have to, this way, the Bluetooth isn't always there, uh, you know, uh, tethered to it and it's eating up the battery to to your phone. But let's see if the WaveNote application has to be open for you to actually have the experience to make things work just right for you. So we're going to leave it on note taking and then we're just going to press it until it, see the record button is on and uh, just the ambient sound from here should be pushing to here. Microphone's right about there. It's a test to see if the microphone works. Remember to always remember to um, press that stop record button and then hold it down till you feel it vibrate and vibrated. Now we're going to launch the wave note application. We're going to remember you have to connect to it. Click on me. See, there it is. It's connected. And then we'll just go there recordings and see, there it is. Voila. The application does not have to be open. And if we press play, the record button is on and uh, just the ambient sound. It works. And if you want to check for firmware updates, really easy. WaveNote is right there. If you just go to about and check version and it's as easy as one, two, three, this is the latest version, just like that. And you always want to make sure you're up to date with your firmware. Now, if you don't want to press that transcribe button all the time, you can just do this transcribe records, right? And you go into settings and then you just press auto transcribe. And now it'll automatically transcribe everything for you. You decide whether or not that feature is ideal. I hope that this video helped you. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down below or ideas for other videos. Remember to like and subscribe and we'll see you all next time.